Hi! In this video, I will introduce the AVR Watchdog Timer. There's an example project linked in the description box, which demonstrates some of the features I will mention. So let's get to it. The Watchdog Timer can function as a general timer for your system, or it can be a safety feature to catch runaway code. Using its own oscillator, the Watchdog Timer runs independently to the rest of the system. Timeout can be configured from 16 milliseconds to 8 seconds. To prevent the system reaching the timeout, the watchdog timer reset instruction must be used to restart the counter. There are three operating modes in the watchdog timer. Interrupt, system reset, and interrupt and system reset. Some devices will have all of these options, and others will only have the system reset option. In interrupt mode, an interrupt will occur when the watchdog timer expires. This interrupt can be used to wake the device from sleep modes and also as a general system timer. One use case would be to limit the maximum time allowed for certain operations, giving an interrupt when the operation has run longer than expected. In system reset mode, the reset will occur when the watchdog timer expires. This is typically used when an application has started to operate incorrectly. The third mode, interrupt and system reset mode, combines the other two modes by first giving an interrupt where, for example, critical information can be saved before initiating a system reset. Be aware of the watchdog always on fuse, which forces system reset mode and does not allow interrupt mode. That was all for today. Stay tuned for more videos covering AVR basics. Thank you.